so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! <laughs> hey! It's me, Blippi! And today, we're here at Dinosaur Encounters, where there are so many dinosaurs! Woo! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Whoa! Check it out! It's a Velociraptor! Oh. Whoa! <laughs> Are you a friendly Velociraptor? Ah, it's really friendly! And what's your name? Pumpkin! <laughs> ah, that's a great name. Well, it's nice to meet you, Pumpkin. You know, Pumpkin, we've been meeting a lot of dinosaurs today. Do you think you could show me and us how to walk like a raptor? Okay, <laughs> let's do it! Whoa, check it out! Whoa! <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah! The raptor walks up on two legs instead of four. Kind of like this. <laughs> Can you walk like a raptor with us? Okay, here we go! <laughs> Whoa, that was great! Thank you, Pumpkin! Oh, and Pumpkin, I also wanted to ask, how does a Velociraptor roar? <laughs> Whoa! That was so loud! A <laughs> great roar! Ooh, can you roar like Pumpkin? Okay, on the count of three, are you ready? One, two, three! Roar! <laughs> Pumpkin, that was a really big roar. <laughs> oh, and speaking of big roars, have you seen a T-Rex around here anywhere? Oh, over there? <laughs> okay, let's go see if we can find one. Bye, Pumpkin. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. I found a baby dinosaur that was all alone. Oh, <laughs> what's your name, baby dinosaur? Oh, its name is Speckles. Oh, that's a really great name. <laughs> but why were you all alone? I didn't see any grown-up dinosaurs taking care of you. Oh no, you're lost? Aw, that's kind of sad, but luckily, Blippi's here to save the day. <laughs> yeah, we can help find Speckles' daycare. Yeah, take it back to the grown-up dinosaur that was taking care of you. Does that sound good? Whoa! Whoa! Okay, let's go help Speckles. Come on! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! We did it! We found the daycare and the grown up dinosaur taking care of Speckles. <laughs> oh, and look, it's Speckles! Oh, but shh! It looks like Speckles is taking a nap. Aww, <laughs> that's a pretty cute dinosaur. Well, thank you for taking care of Speckles. <laughs> oh, was there something you wanted to tell me? Aw, oh, that's so great. <laughs> yeah, they said that we can go inside and play at the daycare with all the other baby dinosaurs. <laughs> thank you. Whoa, I wonder what kinds we'll find. <laughs> Check it out! There are dinosaurs here! It looks like someone's pulling a train along and there's a dinosaur in an orange car, a blue one, and a red car seat. Whoa! No way, look! <laughs> and this one's playing with a little toy truck. It's a garbage truck! <laughs> yeah! I just love a garbage truck. <laughs> yeah, picking up all the trash and recycling. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this. It's a little school bus. <laughs> the wheels on the bus go rah, rah, rah. <laughs> That's silly. <laughs> Whoa, and look. There's a really bumpy, spiky dinosaur. And it looks like it's pulling the train along with its tail. Oh, hey, do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? <laughs> I'll give you a hint. It's spiky with a tail like a hammer. 
<laughs> yeah, that's right. It's a baby Angliosaurus. Aw, <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> Let's go meet some new dinosaurs. <laughs> Whoa, look! They're playing on a seesaw. <laughs> or a Peter totter <laughs> Oh, here, I'll give you a push. Whoa, look at them go! <laughs> and these dinosaurs, they're baby Triceratops. Aw, <laughs> they're having a lot of fun playing, and they're so stylish. They're wearing bow ties. <laughs> well, <laughs> wait a minute. Two tied Triceratops on a teeter-totter? Whoa, <laughs> that is a lot of tees. <laughs> well, I'll see you later, Triceratops. Here we go, woo! <laughs> Whoa, see what it is? It's a giant T-Rex mouth! <laughs> yeah, and this one right here sure looks really bouncy. Woo! Whoa! <laughs> and it looks like you can bounce and slide all the way to the top and all the way to the bottom. <laughs> See you soon! Here we go! Woo! Whoa! 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 <laughs> One! Two, three! Whoa! 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 That was one bouncy T Rex. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. You know what sound a T Rex makes? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's right. A T Rex makes a really big, really loud roar. <laughs> Will you roar like a T Rex with me? Okay, let's do it. Are you ready? Set. Roar! 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 <laughs> well, that was pretty fun roaring like a T-Rex. But wait a minute. This right here is a T-Rex, but it's a bouncy T-Rex. I want to find a real T-Rex. I just know if we keep exploring, we definitely can find one. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa! I can't wait to learn about dinosaurs and be a paleontologist! And do you know, dinosaurs like to eat all kinds of things. Some are carnivores. Ooh, that means they like to eat meat. And other dinosaurs are herbivores. Ooh, and that means they like to eat plants and vegetables. <laughs> I found some really big dinosaurs that are all herbivores because they love those green veggies. <laughs> Come on! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Look at this dinosaur! <laughs> it's so big! Hello! Whoa! This dinosaur is called a Stegosaurus. Wow! <laughs> and this is definitely one big dinosaur. <laughs> It's really big, but don't worry, it's an herbivore. <laughs> yeah, it loves to eat plants and veggies. See, it looks nice. Ah, uh, hello. <laughs> oh, are you having a good day today? Oh, it looks like he is. <laughs> oh, and did you know something? Stegosauruses have plates on their back. Yeah, just like this. See? Whoa. <laughs> it kind of looks like a leaf or a triangle. One, two, three. <laughs> three sides on a triangle. These plates are really important because they protect the stegosaurus, but also they help to regulate its temperature. <laughs> Basically, it keeps it nice and cool when it's hot out, and nice and warm when it's cool. <laughs> oh, you are so cute. <laughs> well, let's see how long this stegosaurus is. <laughs> It's pretty long! Whoa! It's huge! <laughs> oh, and look! There's another one! Come on! Oh, no way! It's a cute little baby stegosaurus! That stegosaurus from earlier was a mama! <laughs> oh, hello, little baby! Aw, <laughs> this is such a cute little baby stegosaurus! <laughs> Yeah, these stegosauruses are really nice. And did you know their brains were the size of a ping pong ball? Whoa, that's pretty small. <laughs> yeah, 
us humans, we have a brain the size of 10 tennis balls. Whoa! That's a lot. <laughs> uh, well, you are one cute baby dinosaur. I'll see you later, okay? I'm gonna go say hi to some of your friends. Bye-bye! <laughs> Let's go! Woohoo! <laughs> Maybe we can feed a dinosaur. Come on! <laughs> Look at these dinosaurs! Wow! Check it out! <laughs> Whoa! I can't believe we're so close to actual dinosaurs! Oh! <laughs> Hello there! <laughs> yeah! These dinosaurs are called Pachycephalosaurus! Whoa! Hello! <laughs> Would you like a little snack? Okay, here we go! <laughs> He took it! <laughs> Aw, that's very sweet. <laughs> yeah, a pachycephalosaurus is also an herbivore. <laughs> See, it's munching on some leaves. <laughs> yeah, it also has a really big head. Look, whoa, it's so smooth. Yeah, it has some spikes on it, but the pachycephalosaurus has this nice, smooth head that's really, really strong. It's strong so that it can protect it, but also for fashion. Woohoo! <laughs> Aw, you are so sweet. Woo. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Looks like this dinosaur has a friend. Aw, <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. I think I see another dinosaur. And this next dinosaur, I'm sure you'll know. I'll give you a hint. It has horns. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, check it out! It's another kind of herbivore. This dinosaur is called a Triceratops. Yeah, and these dinosaurs are super easy to spot because they have one, two, three horns on their head. You see, like this. Whoa, yeah, and this is a mommy Triceratops and it's here with the baby Triceratops. Oh, it's so cute. And look, it even has a beak. <laughs> yeah, and the three horns of a Triceratops are very important because they use them for protection, but also to get the attention of other Triceratops. <laughs> you and I, yeah, we might wave like this. Hello! Hi there! Hello! <laughs> but a Triceratops will probably use its horns like this. Hello! Hello! Whoa! Whoa, <laughs> I'm a little bit dizzy after all that Triceratops waving. <laughs> Wait a minute, do you hear that? It's another dinosaur, come on! <laughs> we did it, it's the T-Rex dinosaur. Ooh, I think it's friendly, let's go say hello. <laughs> hello, Mr. T-Rex. Whoa, <laughs> he is friendly. That's so great. <laughs> How are you today? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> hey, did you know that T-Rex dinosaurs are really, really big? Yeah, they can grow over 40 feet long. <laughs> Whoa, that is really long. And they have giant teeth the size of bananas. <laughs> you know, that's because a T-Rex is a carnivore which means instead of being an herbivore, they eat meat. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was nice to meet you. Whoa. Oh, thanks. <laughs> See you soon, Mr. T-Rex. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa, that was awesome. I had so much fun with you today. Yeah, we found the T-Rex and we were really great paleontologists. We learned so many things and saw an awful lot of dinosaurs. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, here we go. Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>
and it looks like there's a dino behind me. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Dinosaur. <laughs> Do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? <laughs> yeah, it's a Tyrannosaurus Rex or T-Rex. <laughs> they were really big dinosaurs, 40 feet long, 12 feet tall, <laughs> and lived a really long time ago. <laughs> I like T-Rexes because they have really big heads and really teeny tiny arms. <laughs> Let's go find some more dinosaurs. Woo. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> We're here at a dig site. Yeah, where we can dig up and discover fossils. <laughs> oh, good thing I have my trusty brush. Yeah, when you're digging up fossils, you don't want to use a shovel or your hands. You want to use a brush so it's nice and gentle. Because breaking a fossil could mean losing precious information for a scientific discovery. <laughs> yeah, we basically don't want to break the fossils. Well, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> Ooh, let's see what we can find. Whoa, brushing away. <laughs> brush. Whoa! Whoa! Check it out! It's a fossil! <laughs> I wonder if this is a dinosaur. What kind of creature this could be? Whoa! Hmm! Whoa! <laughs> Check it out! Huh! Are those fingers? Whoa! <laughs> this looks really cool! Gotta keep brushing! Whoa! Did you know that people who work to study dinosaurs, they're called paleontologists. <laughs> yeah, I really like dinosaurs, but I'm not a paleontologist. Yeah, paleontologists, they know all about fossils and dinosaurs. Whoa, they study dinosaurs every day. <laughs> That's a lot of dinosaurs. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> it's a dinosaur bone. Whoa, it looks like we found a foot and we found the body. <laughs> I wonder what's over here. Oh, we're getting closer. We're getting closer. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Look, we found its face. Hello. <laughs> Hello, little dinosaur. Well, this isn't a little dinosaur. This looks like a big dinosaur. It looks like a stegosaurus. <laughs> Hello, stegosaurus. Whoa, that's awesome. Whoa, look at this. <laughs> this looks like a really, really big bone, but this isn't a bone, it's a fossil. Hello. <laughs> yeah, well, a fossil might look like a bone, but what happens is a bone falls on the ground and then dirt and mud covers it up. <laughs> then that bone decomposes, it goes away but there's still that space where the bone was and sediment and different material fills it up and turns into a rock. And then a really long time in the future, <laughs> we find it just like this. And that's a fossil that scientists can use to learn about dinosaurs. <laughs> Whoa, check this one out. <laughs> this is a really small fossil. Huh, hmm. this doesn't really look like a dinosaur. Hmm doesn't really look like a bone either. I wonder what it is. Ooh, I don't know what this is, but I bet if we ask, a dino expert can tell us. <laughs> hey, let's go find a dino expert. Hmm, I wonder what this is. <laughs> Whoa, I really wish I knew what this fossil was. Hmm, Ooh, I see someone, maybe they know. <laughs> Hi, I'm Blippi, what's your name? Hi Blippi, I'm Kevin, oh. and I'm a dino expert. Whoa, no way! It is so nice to meet you, Kevin. <laughs> Kevin's a dino expert. Maybe he knows what this is a fossil of. <laughs> Whoa, well Kevin, we found this fossil, but I don't know what it is. Oh yeah, I can totally tell you what this is. This is actually a tooth of an Edmontosaurus. Oh, a tooth? <laughs> Whoa, we didn't know what it was, but it's a tooth of an Edmontosaurus? That's right, yeah, that's this animal right here. Whoa, check it out! <laughs> the Edmontosaurus is so big! <laughs> oh, and look, it does have some teeth up there, and it looks like it has a duck bill. Quack, quack, quack. <laughs> yeah, that duck bill was actually used 
to peck at leaves and pull them off the trees. Whoa, that is amazing. Huh, did it just eat leaves or other things too? Uh, no, this was an herbivore, which means it only eats plants. Whoa, yeah, some dinosaurs were herbivores. <laughs> that means they like to eat lots of plants, but others were carnivores. <laughs> they like to eat meat, and some were omnivores. Yeah, that means they eat meat and vegetables and leaves and plants. <laughs> Whoa, oh, but this tooth looks like lots of teeth. Is this just one tooth? This is just one tooth. It looks like that because uh, this Edmontosaurus used to grind up its food to make it easier to eat. Whoa, <laughs> that's awesome. Hey, that kind of reminds me of a cow. <laughs> Whoa, that's a pretty cool Edmontosaurus. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. Its legs are so big. <laughs> Looks like it's really good at walking. <laughs> yeah, it is, actually. It used to walk on all fours, but if it needed to get higher, uh, like to get trees, leaves off of the trees, uh, it would stand up on two legs to get more height. Wow, did you hear that? <laughs> it could stand up just like you and me, or walk on all fours just like a little puppy dog. <laughs> oh, so silly. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> And I had one other question, Kevin. Yeah? Do all dinosaurs walk on the land? They do, actually. Oh. Yeah. Well, what about dinosaurs that fly in the air or are in the water? Those actually aren't considered dinosaurs. They're oh. called prehistoric creatures. Whoa, prehistoric creatures. Whoa. <laughs> Man, I really hope I can see a prehistoric creature one day. <laughs> hmm. Well, do you know of any prehistoric creatures? I do actually have another one right here. And you know what? He's a little lonely. He needs a friend. Whoa, check it out. It's a prehistoric creature. Whoa. <laughs> and what kind of creature is this? This one's a trilobite. Whoa, a trilobite. <laughs> oh, well, we need to find this trilobite a friend. <laughs> well, thank you, Kevin, for showing me the trilobite and this amazing dinosaur. <laughs> this was so much fun. <laughs> I'll see you later, Kevin. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Let's go find a friend. <laughs> Whoa! There are so many amazing fossils here, just like our little trilobite. Hello! <laughs> yeah, keep your eye out. We might need to find him a friend. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> oh, there's a person. Maybe they can help us. Hi! Hi, Blippi! I'm Laura! Oh, it's nice to meet you, Laura! <gasps> Whoa, and what is that? This is a trilobite! A really big one! Whoa, look! We have a little small trilobite and a really, really big one! <laughs> it's so big! And I bet they're gonna be great friends! Oh, yeah! Hey, good friends like to dance! Let's do the trilobite dance! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> these trilobites are really good dancers. <laughs> wow, this is a really amazing fossil. Yeah, and these trilobites, they lived underwater? They did, they are prehistoric arthropods, which means that they're related to bugs and crabs. Whoa, did you hear that? This isn't a dinosaur, no. A trilobite is an arthropod? An arthropod. <laughs> Whoa, that is a really big name. <laughs> it is. But it just means that the trilobite is a really, really old bug. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. Laura, is this a dinosaur? No, actually, this is a prehistoric marine reptile. <laughs> Whoa, a prehistoric marine reptile? So it's not a dinosaur? No, it's not. Dinosaurs lived on land, but oh. there are other creatures that flew in the sky and swam in the sea, like yeah. this one. This is Tylosaurus. Ooh, hello, Tylosaurus. <laughs> hey, this is a Tylosaurus. This is a Tylosaurus. Yeah, <laughs> it's a Tylosaurus. Ooh, let's give it a name. We should call this Tylosaurus Tyler. <laughs> I think that's a great name. Hello, Tyler. Hi, Tyler. <laughs> oh, and it looks like Tyler has a lot of teeth. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and do you see? Tyler is really, really big. <laughs> he looks almost as big as a T-Rex. <laughs> he is. He's almost the same length as a T-Rex. You could call him the T-Rex of the ocean. Whoa, check him out. <laughs> 
Wow. It's really cool. Do you see that spot on his jaw that looks like a break? It's actually not a break in his jaw, it's a hinge. Tylosaurus could unhinge its jaw to swallow prey whole. Whoa, did you hear that? Tyler can unhinge his jaw. <laughs> yeah, you've probably seen a hinge before. Yeah, a hinge goes like this. <laughs> Doors have hinges and Tyler has a hinge for his jaw. So he can open up really wide. <laughs> to eat lots of yummy food. <laughs> well, thank you so much for teaching me all about prehistoric creatures. <laughs> I'll see you later, Laura. Bye. There you go. <laughs> okay, let's keep looking for some more dinosaurs and fossils. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>